Good morning, Red Mill Elementary, and welcome to Dolphin Daybreak News. Today is Wednesday, March 31st, 2021. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please observe a moment of silence. And now for today's announcements. Today is the last day of March, which means it's the last day of reading month. Let's check out today's reading month calendar activity. Today's activity for our kindergarten and first graders is to draw a picture of your family and label each family member with initials or their name. Today's activity for our second through fifth graders is to write three would you rather questions to ask a classmate or someone at home. Remember to turn in your completed reading month calendars to your teachers so you can be entered to win these awesome prizes. Good luck. For our students who are participating in the PBS Kids Writers Contest, here's a reminder to have an adult at home help you mail in your entry to WHRO. All entries are due by April 2nd. Today is the last day of Women's History Month and the last Wednesday in March. So now it's time for our final segment of A Woman in History Wednesday. Today's featured woman is Bindi Irwin. Bindi was born July 24, 1998 in Australia. Her parents managed the Australia Zoo where they lived and she grew up learning about animals. Bindi's parents were animal conservationists. Her dad, Steve, who starred on TV as the crocodile hunter, died when she was young. She followed in her dad's footsteps by working to protect animals around the world. Bindi works with a wildlife charity her parents created, and her family also continues to run the Australia Zoo. Bindi hopes to inspire other adults and children to want to help animals too. You can learn more about Bindi and other awesome girls and women in history on Pebble Go or head to the library. And finally, remember to be safe, be respectful, and be responsible. Have a great day of learning.